in today's video, you might be wondering what the hell this is. This is a bunch of different companies vegan chicken nuggets. So we're gonna test try every single one of them and we're gonna do it blindfolded because we don't want no bias. Are you ready? I'm ready! Woo! I forgot to introduce. This is Rob, my Rob. husband. Yes. Hubby. I'm married. Woo! I'm gonna blindfold her and I'm gonna pick random pieces and I'm gonna give it to her and she's gonna rate them. The way we're rating these chicken nuggets is one, the smell, two, the taste, three, texture, and four, the price. All right, blindfold me. I'm ready. I'm nervous. Okay, so we're about to taste test. In the end, we'll give the results. So right now I'm gonna pick a random one and I'm gonna see what she thinks and she won't know. So I'm gonna... <laughs> Okay, so <laughs> that's what I say all the time, my baby. Which piece am I gonna get? Huh? Stop this just... one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. Can you tell? Can make you tell? make sure you voice your voice. Can you tell which piece? No, I can't see nothing, man. Yeah, take a bite. Take a bite. smell it let me describe the texture the texture there's more wheat and like it's really crunchy like the breading is really crunchy and but very little chicken on the inside it's uh, more more crust more more bread, bread. Than, yeah more crust than the chicken up it has a lot of a lot of different seasoning on this particular one so it tastes kind of so it tastes good it's flavorful yeah, it's flavorful. So I would probably give this a nine out of ten. I really like this chicken nugget. Oh, okay. Can you just give it to me? Okay, ready? <laughs> Take a bite, small bite. I know which one this is. This is Gardein. How do I know? I thought I liked Gardein a lot. Previous one, don't tell me if I'm right or wrong either. The previous one actually tastes better than the Gardein. So this one, I probably give, wow, I'm probably gonna give this one a seven out of 10. There's more chicken to it, but the chicken doesn't taste as good as the last one. But I like the breading a bit more on this one because it's not as seasoned-ish. Like it's simple flavors. It tastes like a fried chicken. Open, take a bite. Oh, mm -mm. no, no, no. I don't like this one. It don't taste good. I don't like this one at all. Again, it's more crusty than chicken, but the chicken tastes really weird. It's like they put so much seasoning into it that you, you're kind of confused. You don't taste the so chicken it, so part it of it? So it tastes weird. I don't know if it's the, the crust that tastes like that or if it's the actual bread that tastes like that. This is my least favorite. I think I give this a, I'll give this a two out of ten. Whoa, I whoa, whoa. I didn't whoa. like this one at all. We're putting people out of business with this review. Yeah, I have a We're putting people out of business with this review. I have a feeling this is the Whole Foods one. Right. <laughs> oh. I know which one to say. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Finger licking good. Mm. This is KFC one. The crust is very minimal. It tastes like a, a an original KFC chicken. Doesn't, the crust is not trying to hide the chicken. Yeah, the crust doesn't hide the chicken. There's more chicken than crust. It doesn't taste rubbery, but it tastes like KFC. Like if you ever ate KFC back in back in your childhood, as is just the nostalgia. So you bet really... money this is your KFC one. I bet money. And what's your what's your uh, what's your score? I'm actually, I'm gonna give this an eight out of ten. I really do eight like. Out of 10. Yeah, I like the first one a lot more. Wow. All right, ready? Bite. Uh, I personally don't like it because even though it has like a crispy crunch to it, not a lot of meat, it tastes bland. Maybe if I put in like ketchup or something, it would taste better. Does it taste like chicken? No, this does not taste like chicken. Okay. This tastes like a vegan mock meat chicken. Like okay. it doesn't taste real like the KFC one. So I would probably give this a five out of 10. So now it's my turn to get blindfolded and do the test. <laughs> and you have to choose ones that have not been bit. But you gotta, wait, let me see. Yeah. Yeah, I knew it was. Okay. This is the simulated chicken. We're gonna go through the rating, okay? Yeah, tell me which one is. Gardein, 7 out of 10. Mm -hmm. Whole Foods, 9 out of 10. <gasps> KFC, 8 out of 10. Nugs, 5 out of 10. Morningstar, 2 out of 10. No way! I could I thought I, this. Oh my. Okay, okay. I got wrong. I thought this. 
this one was Whole Foods. I'm sorry, Whole Foods. Blindfold me. And... I don't know. <laughs> Okay, open your mouth. Take a bite. Which one is that? Here's a KFC one. It's good. Has it taste? What are your thoughts? Tell us. I can't explain it. You must explain. A little crunchy. I'm not sure if it's a KFC now. I have to try the other ones. Okay. Crunchy. The chicken. What's what your I rated rate it at? Yeah. Eight out of ten. Okay. Does it taste like real chicken? Damn, I don't know. I'll say yeah. I'll say yeah. It does taste kind of chickenish. Yeah, it does. Okay, ready? Bite down. Ew, so much bread. Burnt bread. This has a bunch of burnt bread. This is the morning star. <laughs> What's the taste? You have to describe the taste. It has like breading. It tastes like bread with a little bit of rubbery. Ew, it tastes burnt. The chicken, the, the breading doesn't taste good. It tastes like if someone took vegan mock meat like soy and like dip it in burnt breadcrumbs <laughs> and then just baked it and gave it to me. <laughs> it doesn't taste good. Okay, what would you rate that? I think a two out of ten. Ready? Okay, bite down. It doesn't taste that good. This is the Gardein one because it's so thick. The the breading is so super crunchy, but the chicken tastes weird. I would give that a, you know, a three out of 10. Oh man, it's nasty. All right, next one, bite down. What do you think? You're giving me some nasty. Is it more chicken, more breadcrumb? This one tastes, it had more chicken, but I noticed that the breadcrumb flavor really dictates the, the taste of the whole chicken. You taste the seasoning and you don't really taste the chicken. You don't enjoy the texture. I didn't like this one. This is like a three out of 10. Three out of 10? It's oh, disgusting. wow, okay. Okay, last one, you ready? Garbage. Garbage? Garbage. Garbage. <laughs> Two out of 10. Why? No, one out of 10. Has no flavor. Crust is super crunchy. Like it's not thick, thick. It's just super hard and crunchy. And then the inside has no flavor. Whatsoever, right? Doesn't taste good. <laughs> okay, you can take off your blindfold. I'm gonna tell you your thing. Okay. So the Gardein, you gave it a three out of 10. Okay. You said it was too much, too much bread. Didn't taste good. This one, which I was actually surprised because this was my favorite one. You gave it the Whole Foods one a three out of 10. Okay. You think it would taste better with sauce? I think all these would taste better with sauce. But like when you have no sauce, you really get to taste if it's a really thing. chicken like okay. nugget. Tastes like poop. It's not real chicken. Seriously. Tastes like poop, not real chicken. This you get is the Nugs ones, the simulate one. One out of ten, it's poop. Yeah, yeah, because it, it I, had no flavor. Yeah, I didn't like this either because it reminded me of the Gardein Mandarin chicken one. It's I just don't like the taste. It has no flavor. Like if I want to eat mock real chicken, it's not. It has it. no flavor. Not it. Mm. Morning Star was the worst one for both of us. It was overly seasoned. Yeah, and nor you gave it two out of ten. And normally I never liked Morning Star. I just felt like they never did. Their products were yeah, not. Yeah, I never liked their products. Especially compared to like these other brands like Gardein. Yeah. Morningstar never kept up. So the KFC was the 8 out of 10. So the KFC did. one was the 8 out of 10. You said that was the one that tasted most like real chicken. And the KFC one is made out of Beyond Me. You gave me the first one, the KFC one. Yeah. So now that I taste, if you would have given me the other ones first and in the middle given me that or at the end, I would have given that a 10 out of 10. Because after 10 I tasted this, that's a 10 out of 10 compared to all this. Yeah, because it tasted pretty good, but I didn't know how good it was until I saw how bad these were. I guess I was more uh, generous with my ratings. <laughs> I actually thought these tasted really bad. And I'm actually surprised because I really liked the Gardein one. I guess it tastes better with sauce. I, we would have to try this all with sauce. You know, this one's not so bad. It has good soy in it. it has a good amount of soy. This has no soy in it or whatever. It has nothing. It's so tiny. So the winner for you is KFC chicken nuggets. And the winner for me is the Whole Foods one with coming in second, the KFC, for sure. I have no second. They all suck. They all suck. Except the KFC. The KFC was really good. These two are our winners. KFC and, and Whole, Whole Foods. Foods. Yay! <laughs> Thank you for joining us on this test tasting experience with our vegan chicken nuggets. Thank you guys for watching our video. Uh, we appreciate all the love. Don't forget to like and subscribe this video down there. Also, don't forget to comment, share some love, say something good, put some positivity in our comment section. Much love to everybody. Love you all. Bye. Until the next video. Next video. Nice. Chicken nugget.